This is a place where beauty and danger go hand in hand. A legendary river, raging water all around. A boat and paddle, your only salvation. This is Whitewater Kayak. You uh, find yourself upside down in this container with your legs trapped in there, so to speak, and your mind can play games with you. you have to keep it together. A few more days. I'm just losing myself in the river right now. I'm losing myself in the river. I've trained a week to get in these waters. Now it's time to find out if I can get myself out. When you grow up in Louisiana, dreaming of climbing a mountain is like dreaming of going to the moon. I had fun as a kid, playing baseball, vacationing with the family, and riding my bike. But I craved something more. I just didn't know what. I finally got a taste of adventure at 18 when I scaled Africa's tallest peak, Mount Kilimanjaro. This was what I'd been looking for. As a mountaineer, I've conquered the seven summits, including Mount Everest, a few times. But now I'm looking for new ways to activate. So join me as I travel the globe, attempting the wildest and most intense challenges imaginable, all in the name of adventure. I am Jovio Gwynn. I am the Adventurist. way, way, way bigger than it looked from the helicopter yesterday. I don't know if I'm gonna have more than one shot at it. I'm gonna put my heart into it and just do everything I can. That's all I can do. Here we go. Welcome to South America, home to some of the most beautiful and dangerous landscapes in the world. I'm flying here in search of my ultimate destination, Patagonia. The mountains of Patagonia are world famous. Taking a stab at climbing some of these peaks, though, will have to wait. On this trip, it's another aspect of the region that I've come for, the powerful waters of the Futalafu River. Buda, as it's known, winds through the Andean corridor of northern Patagonia like a ribbon of turquoise with a mesmerizing blend of power and beauty. And this power and beauty is now calling out to me. My mission learn to kayak, then conquer the Himalaya, a deadly class four whitewater rapid in just one week.
After nearly 20 hours of flying due south, I finally touched down on the southern tip of Chile, home to some of the most amazing and dangerous whitewater in the world. And for half the year, it's also home to this guy, Chris Spelius. Chris. Jovio Goyan. Christmas, good to <laughs> meet you. Welcome to Patagonia. Oh, thanks, what thanks you, so much. What do you think of Hopefully, that Hopefully, he is going to teach me all I need to know to not only run the rapid, but to stay alive. Paddler Magazine says Chris is a legend. Several national championships, competing in the Olympics. And more to the point, he headed to South America in 1980 and pioneered kayaking in the Fuda River in 1986. He's never left. Trying to go from zero to class four in a week is going to be tough, but I'm more than lucky that this is the guy I'm counting on to get me out of here in one piece.